Have you ever edited a video? You're super proud of it. And guess what? It's getting views. It's doing good. And then you watch it yourself after it's up and you're like, oh shoot. The voiceover is delayed. There's a part with no music. Maybe you're just worried about the whole article 13. So you want to take out a snippet of a GIF that you put in. Well, I'm going to show you a super easy way to just cut out a portion, a section of your video and keep your video on so that you don't have to lose all those views, baby. Let's do this. Rise up creators, it's your girl Dre here with Clueless Tips, the community where we go from clueless to I got this on everything that is YouTube. And today I'm gonna show you how to remove sections of your video without needing to delete them. If you haven't seen my other video on what the heck is Article 13 and what it means to us as far as copyright goes and small YouTubing, make sure you check out this video after it will be in the description or on the end screen. But basically because of that, I knew it was important to put this video out. And also it comes in handy when we just make some mistakes in our video. So I'm gonna walk you through uh, one of the videos I just put up, it actually has super low views, but I love it. It's actually one of my favorite videos I've done on my other channel, answering assumptions about me. And I just put a little clip of R. Kelly in there because I thought it was hilarious. I'm not gonna show you that clip because of the whole Article 13 and the new things that might be happening with copyright stuff. So before I show you how to remove R. Kelly from your videos, make sure you subscribe and hit the bell so you don't miss any upcoming Clueless to I Got This videos because I always share what helps me grow from my other channel on here so we can turn things up together as small YouTubers. Let's do this. So I'm in YouTube Studio Beta and I actually discovered they changed how to do this and it's no longer available in the other form. So at first I was like, do I go to this edit bar up here? No, that's not the right way. You go into the video section of Studio Beta and click on the video you want to remove a section of. And here it is. You click on the sidebar here, this little editing feature, and voila, editing just got easier. So this is me laughing at my own joke <laughs> in the video here. And there's some cool features. You can even add a blur there. So I'm not gonna get into all of the details, but definitely play around. Here's the keyboard shortcuts in case you're not familiar with editing in this kind of style, but I thought it was pretty similar to iMovie. You just move this bar over and press trim when you're ready to trim. But I wanna show you guys another feature over here to the left since we have been talking about copyright issues. You can actually just add audio. So let's say you have something with music that's copywritten or has a claim and you wanna change that. You can lower that and go straight into YouTube's audio library here and you know pick a, a file and go ahead and add that to your video. So let's get back to the trim, the reason you are here, the reason you're watching. I press trim, I'm gonna go ahead and stretch out the video clip so I can see where R. Kelly is, <laughs> where I'm poking fun of R. Kelly, here it is. If you guys haven't seen R. Kelly have his little tantrum over the hot water he's rightfully so getting into, it's pretty funny. So I was making fun of a zit I had and then I kind of threw a fit like R. Kelly and showed a clip of it and it was hilarious, but I don't have the rights to do it. So I'm removing that uh, because of the whole, you know, scary article 13 stuff if you don't know that make sure you check out that video right after this but you just dry drag drag the cursor over i want to keep that little section in here that little what is that called comment below when the tv screen makes that noise and then i'm just going to stretch it over get rid of r kelly <laughs> in my video and off the streets and yeah so you can see it's there if you go here and press X, that's gonna change what you just did and you're gonna start over, but just go up here, press play, and then set the cursor back to where you want and just see if it runs smooth. And I think because I did have that TV thing, it just kind of clips. People probably won't even notice what I meant. And I move on with my video and press save. Then you get this pop-up disclaimer because it is a permanent thing. You cannot change this. Once you do this, it's done. It's irreversible. And it says here that it does take a few hours to process. So it is gonna take some time. And so just press save. 
That's it guys. Easy peasy squeezy. Subscribe if you found value in this. And make sure you check out my other tips videos if you haven't already. And if you haven't already checked out this video about Article 13, let's have a discussion about it because it applies to all of us and it's pretty big news as far as YouTube goes. Alright guys, till the next tips videos, let's turn things up together and that's my son. Say turn it up. Turn it up.